What's up, YouTube? Y'all already see what it is, man. A Reese, No Man's Land. Highly, highly requested, man. I hear y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm not ignoring nobody requests. But this joint right here had like 30 thumbs up on one person just requesting it. So I'm going to jump into it, man. Like I say, man, Stogie T and all them, man. I'm about to get it back into all them, man. Black, I'm about to get into all them. Trust me, man. Youngster CPTA, all them, man. I see y'all. I hear y'all request. I do. Tupac. I'm a man. Listen, man. I hear everybody request. Trust me. Let's get it. Let's go, man. Let's get it. Let's go. <laughs> You know what I'm saying, man? What I like about A. Reese, he's what I would call a pure rapper. Like, he's a natural. You can hear it. Like, you can just tell a pure rapper, man, when you just can just spit. You could just, you could just, it's hard to explain, but you can just tell. Like, his flow is, it's not penetratable, man. Like, it's easy for him. Like, this ain't some shit he just wrote down or... He probably just went into the studio and just said it, man. You could tell it's, it's natural, period. It's natural. Hey man, then he kicking the hardest lyrics. If you listen to what he's saying, he's talking about dude working nine to five. He hate it. He can't quit. Same shit. He's saving up so his son can at least go to college so he don't have to be doing what he doing. I get where he's going with this, man. This is crazy. Take it back. Man, basically what he just saying is the baby mama don't give a damn about going shopping for the baby. All she care about is Prada and going shopping for the next. Man, in other words, the baby mama ain't shit. Like, basically. Sorry, ladies, but that's that's what he's saying, though. I mean, the vivid, the picture that he's painting, you know what I'm saying? That's what I see. Like, like that's what I see. Like, <laughs> Even started, he couldn't leave it to his baby mama. She doesn't even shop for baby products. She's more concerned about the latest product and going fishing for a richer father. My nigga really got a lot to bear. And here I was thinking beefing with these rappers was a serious problem. Niggas in the hood got bigger problems. I like this split if you tell me pass it. Nigga, I ain't trying to think about it. Now, hold up, man. Now he's talking about. He thought beefing with these rappers was a problem, but niggas in the hood got real bigger problems and stuff. First of all, if you beefing with a rap rappers, you know what I'm saying? Like whoever the sharpest man, whoever polished their microphone the most is going to always win. Like always, whoever master their craftsmanship, like that's who's going to come out on top. Like far as lyrically, like, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no comparison, you know what I'm saying? Like, far as, like, music go, like, that's just what that is. But real-life obstacles, man, that's something totally different right there. Trust me, I don't have my share of up and downs, man. Me and Miss Barcatcher, so I know what he mean by that. 
I wasn't always like this, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all see all this crazy shit, man. I ain't always have stuff like this, man. I ain't always have all the fancy cars and shit that I got now. You know what I'm saying? I really thank God, and I count my blessings, for real, to be in a position to even come and talk to y'all, you know what I'm saying, by doing YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I always wanted to do this, and I can do it now. So, you know what I'm saying? I count my blessings, too. I get it. Hey man, see, I know this every bar, man, and I hate to keep pausing like this talking about it, but that is so true, man. Some people never get what they fantasize. A lot of times, you know, you wishing. You wishing you could do this. You wishing you could do that. But it never comes true, man. That's a, that's the true reality of some situations. Not all of them because dreams do come true. You know what I'm saying? Like I was saying just a minute ago, I wanted to do YouTube. Now, look at me. I'm doing YouTube because I didn't give up on my dream. You know what I'm saying? But this is, yeah, that's some real shit right there. Had to give him all the credit on the effort Cause he's working on a nine to five Some people never get what they fantasize Stay humble to your roots when you grow in life Some niggas stay crying on the prison line Some niggas say he born for the third life Back to where I belong That shit nasty Can't forget where I'm from Never The way that beat switching up. Yeah, it's a war going on outside. Nobody's safe from. Niggas ain't got a license but got a handgun. He's gonna <laughs> shoot but ain't never been to the range once. And they ain't even turned 21 Blood on the streets, cover your eyes He won't make it out alive Don't get your life taken by niggas you try to take from Now it's back to back murders It's black on black slaughter These killers got good lawyers, yo Yeah Man, he says Black on black slaughter These killers got good lawyers Man, you know what I'm saying And that's how it be Unfortunately Especially if you in the dope game that shit right there is, man. And again, it amazes me how in South Africa, they going through the same trials and tribulations we going through over here in the States. It ain't that much different. Y'all ain't that different than what we are. You know what I'm saying? And I'll be in the comment section and a lot of people be asking me, they be like, yo, man, you be giving South Africa all these props and all this credit and stuff. Yo, what's up with that, man? Because I see that the similarities, y'all ain't that much different than where we are. You know what I'm saying? So it come natural. I talk to y'all like I talk to the people over here. Ain't no difference. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all going through the same trials and tribulations, period. To back murders, it's black on black slaughter. These killers got good lawyers, yeah. Huh? Yeah, not as good and bad or a black and white lawyer. Depends what you afford a nigga. Yeah, now we're back to black slaughter and back to back trauma. The streets is out of order, nigga. Heard them say with a gun, money come quick. Same gun, they gon' try and take your life with. Losing people to the violence could be anyone. Same violence that we tryna run away from. One minute you hit it. Next minute you not all depending on the nigga who be calling the shots. Trigger finger trying to take you for the shit that you got. That bullet in the barrel might be killing the sun. Some niggas are lost, some niggas are found. Some niggas in the dirt with no burial ground. Mm. It's a blessing if you made it past 21. Man, he say some niggas in the in the dirt with no burial ground. It's a blessing if you made it past 21. Hold up, man. That's crazy.
Every kid in the sun, some niggas are lost, some niggas are found, some niggas in the dirt with no burial ground. It's a blessing if you made it past 21. Gun violence is just something you ain't safe from. Mm. 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 Facts, man. Facts. That's crazy, man. No man's land. Gun violence is something that you was just safe from. Man. Like I said, these dudes kicking lyrics so hard, man. I really, really enjoy doing this music, man, because it's just the factual actuals, man. Any rapper for that matter that's kicking facts like that, keeping it 100, I'm all about it. But it's your boy D-Reaction. That was my last video for the day. I'm about to edit it up and post it up. I hope y'all enjoying these reactions. Like I say, Miss Barcatcher will be back. Y'all know she in and out now. Y'all don't kind of figure that out. You know what I'm saying? But your boy gonna hold it down, man. And I'm the type of person, like, I got good energy and high energy. And I keep it real. I can only react to stuff because... It take a lot to excite me, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't hear so much music. I don't hear so many lyrics, you know what I'm saying? And I'm going to talk about it. If it ain't that great, I'm going to call it out. But if it is, then I'm, I'm going to call that out too, you know what I'm saying? If it's just okay, I'm going to call it out, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to react accordingly as I should, and I know most of y'all agree with that. Can't give a fake reaction. I don't never look at videos like I heard a lot of reactors do. That's what they. That's how they know what to pause it at and talk about certain stuff. I don't do that. You know what I'm saying? And when I'm doing an artist such as like A. Reese, everything he say is really a bar breaker. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people get in the comment section and be like, you missed a lot of bars, but I miss no bars. I don't miss no bars. You know what I'm saying? I just can't keep pausing talking about this and talking about that, even though the last couple of videos I don't elaborate more than I usually do because I know that's what y'all want me to do. But, you know, it's all good, though. I don't mind talking about the bars, man, because, um, yeah, that's why I'm here. But other than that, man, like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you can be notified every time we upload a video on the channel. Thumbs up. Let YouTube know y'all like the content. And, uh, yeah, man, just keep on sending me your requests. Like I say, I'm not ignoring requests. Just overwhelmed with them a little bit. I will get to everybody request though, man, because I write them down, man. I put them in my pad, in my iPhone. I put them on my damn, uh, what you call that shit, tablets. It's everywhere, man. I wrote them down. I got stickies over there on the wall. It's crazy, man. But, um, yeah, no worries there, man. But it's your boy D-Reaction, man, checking out the reaction box. I'm going to holler at y'all in the next reaction. Let's get it. Let's go. Peace. Now I got to go edit up and post this shit up, man. The job is never done.